Hello and welcome to Tech Idea. Here we make tutorials on topics that might help you in one way or the other. We get a question a lot, that is how to use Outlook effectively. Now, if you want to use Outlook effectively, first of all, you'll need to do all of these other than this one. You don't need to upgrade to Microsoft 360. Second of all, you want to set up your calendars. You want to set up your important dates, the dates where you either have a submission or you have a meeting. You want to set up all of that. If you want, you can also set up birthdays of people that's important to you. But let's get to the main part. We want to confirm our time zone. Now, we don't live in the United States of America, so we don't want that time zone, obviously. We want to set the time zone that is according to our country and it's gonna take some time for you to search but I can't seem to find my country time here so I guess we will be avoiding this for now I'm just gonna take another quick scroll honestly I might be going blind people <laughs> anyways I can't seem to be finding my time zone and you know what this is close close enough All right and you want to set up your format on how you want to look so for me this is better and my time zone format I like it and if, if it's in 24 hour format so with that we want to Go to our appearance, save that obviously. You can select whatever appearance you want. Normally, I like it to be aesthetically black. That's better, easier for your eyes. And just save it. Oh, and if you want, you can turn on dark mode. That's just easier for the eyes. Save that, and that should be done. But this is just for you. It's not to use it effectively or anything. So we close that. Import your contacts, this is important. You should import your contacts. Obviously, I'm not going to import my contacts here right now, but you should import your contacts. With that, it's going to be easier for you to email or, you know, send a message. Basically an email, but it's going to be easier for you to contact those people that's important. For example, your business partners or whatever. And you want to get Outlook for your mobile phone and log in using the same email so that even when you're on the go, you can use Outlook. So, And you can also access the emails that people are sending you. Hopefully, this video helped you in one way or the other. Thank you for watching. And if, this, if you liked the video, drop a like. And if you want to see more tutorials like this, don't forget to hit the subscribe button as well as hit the notification bell. Thank you so much for watching.